Heroes, my heroes. Sad days. <laughs> What's up guys? Riley from Hudson Motors here. Today is a very special day. Today is the day that Ethan, the winner of our 68 Wagoneer LS swapped giveaway, uh, my favorite truck we've ever given away yet and probably will be my favorite truck for a long time. I love this giveaway truck. The winner, Ethan, is coming down today to pick it up. He's got his truck and his trailer. Normally we'd fly the winners down and they drive the truck home, but he wanted to come down and just trailer it. He's up in Wyoming. And so he was like, you know what? It's not that far of a drive. So he's coming down today. We're really pumped about it. It was a great giveaway. And Ethan was ecstatic when we chose him as the winner. His wife was like F-bombing us on the phone. Like, no, I don't way. Like she was, it was great. And that's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, I like it. So really excited. I'm, I'm pumped for him. I, I'm glad it's going to a really good home and I'm really glad about it. But I want to tell a story real quick about kind of how that giveaway went down. It was a very stressful and very weird giveaway. You know, we the giveaway closed on December 17th. We were picking the winner on December 23rd. So like the day before Christmas Eve. And it was gonna be a great Christmas surprise for somebody and it was gonna be rad. And we got everything ready to go. We got some confetti cannons to make it a little more exciting. We picked the winner and everything. It was really cool. We picked the winner and we picked a guy named Wyatt uh, from here from Nevada, from Overton, Nevada, which is just like an hour away from Las Vegas. So we were stoked, you know, he had participated in multiple giveaways, you know, he was out in Overton. And so we were stoked because it was going to be just an easy transition. And so with him just being right there in Overton, we were going to put on the tow truck, drive it out to him, drop it off, take him for a ride, you know, hang out with him for a little bit. And it was going to be an easy transition. So we were excited. And then, you know, we do our, our giveaways through a website called random.org, which is 100% guaranteed random randomness. And the random.org website, they save all of your information and all of the entries so that, you know, if you have a person who believes that you're cheating, they can go on, they can verify their entries, they can see the winner, all that kind of stuff. We do that for, for just general transparency with our giveaways and we do them live. You know, it always reminds me back to that Bill O'Reilly tidbit where he, you know, he was a younger guy on Fox News and they kept trying to film it and film it and film it and it was coming up to the time where they needed to, to put out his segment. He was like, F it, we'll do it live, you know. No. We'll do it live! Do it live! I can, I'll write it and we'll do it live! Sometimes when you're doing stuff live, uh, it, uh, sometimes when you're, when you're doing a live drawing like this, things can go wrong. And this time something went wrong. So after the drawing was over, we're all pumped, we're excited, we're cleaning up all the confetti, and I start getting some emails like, hey, I, I went onto random.org and my entries weren't in. I verify the entries manually, I make sure everybody's good to go, everyone got their correct entries, and I'm thinking, there's no way. I verified every entry the night before, everything was good to go. I thought, no way, and, and I looked at my spreadsheet, and on my spreadsheet, everybody's names were there. You know, I take that spreadsheet and I put it in the random.org and everything, and so I looked at it, I was like, no, your names are right here, I don't know why they're not popping up on random org but I but they went in and uh, had more people email in and and it was like oh crap S -s -s you know when I went to copy in all of those names uh, you know a small chunk of names they didn't get put in and I don't know how but they didn't get copied and pasted over and and you know we're doing it live and and I'm kind of putting it in and doing the random.org thing live and everything and it just slipped you know and and uh, and so there were, and so and so the way that the giveaways work is, you know, there's a rules page, and those rules page or that rules page is like a legally binding contract to me and to anybody who's participating in these giveaways. And so, you know, I in that rules page, I say that hey, everybody's entries will be counted and put in, and and everybody's entries weren't counted and put in, and so that first drawing was null and void. Uh, we were kind of looking at it from every avenue, you know, do we give those people who got shorted entries to the next giveaway X, Y, and Z, and. And it was like, you know, it just wasn't going to work. Legally, we needed to let everybody who had their entries get into that giveaway and make sure it went right. So I had to call Wyatt back and, you know, just feeling terrible, pit my stomach, had to apologize to the guy and say, hey, we are so sorry, but you know, you're actually not the winner, which is a terrible phone call to make. Um, however, I said, hey, Wyatt, do you have a truck? Do you have a pickup that, you, that we could fix up for you? And, you know, I could do a little work for you and make it right. And he was like, yeah, I've got a 90s Ford and OBS F-150. And I was like... I know OBS trucks really freaking well. Um, he's like, yeah, I was in a car accident, frame's a little bent, needs a little cleaning up. So we're gonna straighten his frame. Uh, well, I'll take the camera outside and show you guys his truck. It's out in the yard right now. So we're gonna get his frame straightened and uh, polish up his paint and clean up his interior good and fix some other dingleberries that his truck has. And we're gonna take really good care of Wyatt. So he'll be fine and he's he's stoked because um, he'll have his truck back and, 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 and that'll be good. After that was all said and done, you know, this is still December 23rd. I'm exhausted by now. Mentally, physically, everything. I'm just exhausted. Follow us on Instagram. You watch me post the the second drawing. I've got like massive bags under my eyes. I'm exhausted during that time, but so we get on 
uh, no frills, no nothing. My wife wasn't home. The kids were asleep. It was just me. I just went on to random.org. I got made sure all the entries were put in and picked a new winner and we picked Ethan. And I called Ethan, but I called Ethan and, and my caller ID, because we both have Verizon, pops up and it says Hodson R. And he answers the phone all skeptically like, hello? And I'm like, hey, is this Ethan? He's like, yes. I was like, hey, Ethan, this is Riley Hodson from Hodson Motors. How are you? He's like, good. Why are you calling me? I was like, you know, I'm just calling you because we had to redraw and uh, you're actually the winner. And he just hooting and hollering. He's like, no way, dude, I've had the crappiest day because I just, I love that Wagoneer and I just had to have it. And the fact that I didn't win just kind of bummed me out. And and this is awesome. So it was great. Ethan, uh, the, the real winner, uh, Ethan's participated in like every single giveaway we've done. He's been a long, long, long time customer. So it was really cool for him. And then after he won, he picked to do some other modifications to the truck, which have been cool and fun to do. So we've done those and now he's coming down. He'll be here at 10 o'clock. It's like nine o'clock right now. So just kind of getting everything staged and ready for him. Really excited. It's gonna be a fun time. But yeah, that's the story of how I screwed up and uh, you know, I'm having to take care of another guy's truck because I screwed up, but it's all good. Uh, it was a crazy day, but a massive learning experience for me as well to just like take my freaking time, just slow down. I talk fast, I work fast, I do a lot of things probably too quickly, and uh, it bit me in the butt that time. Um, you know, we are a small, small business. Uh, these giveaways that we do, they are just me. You know, it used to just be me and my wife and we would do it every night after we put our kids to bed. And then Sterling, my right hand man, he came on and I've always had my mechanic Jaime who works with me and he and I have always put the trucks together kind of in the daytime and then we, me and my wife would do the giveaways in the nighttime. So I was working like 24 hours a day besides when I was sleeping. And, you know, and then I brought on my buddy Sterling. So really it's just three of us, maybe sometimes four when my wife can come help. But we're finally out of our house and into our shop. We cleared out the side bay, you know, the smaller bay of our shop and, and put all of the shirts that you can see behind us, filled this whole entire place up. But really we're small and so, you know, I think that that mess up with Wyatt and Ethan kind of showed just kind of the, you know, we're just still learning and we're just kind of amateurs, you know. I, people think that we're like super pros and everything, but it's like, you know, we screw up and, and you know, we're still pretty much figuring this out, you know, eight giveaways in. So. Um, I'm stoked for Ethan, and when he gets here, we're gonna go out there and have a good time with him. Uh, let's walk out first before Ethan gets here. Let's go show you um, Wyatt's truck uh, before we leave. Blazer coming along. Did a ton of wiring, headlight wiring, and everything yesterday, so that thing's coming along. And I got our Dakota digital gauges in yesterday, so that was really exciting. So let's go show you guys Wyatt's truck here and see what you think. I mean, it, it, it needs some work, you know? Bunch of other trucks out here right now. Current giveaway truck. Uh, 92 flare side. It's a great looking truck. My little daily, my V8 Colorado uh, 66 crew cab. Very rare. Everyone's always trying to buy it. FJ45 crew cab back there. Um, really cool truck. It's a BJ45 crew cab. My bad, but long tail. Really cool. The Wagoneer that's coming to pick up today. Future giveaway truck. This Bullnose Dually. We're going to four wheel drive and turbo it. That's a Fargo Power Wagon crew cab. Like one of one. Really cool. Uh, a buddy's truck here. Uh, my Dodge crew cab, my first gen crew cab. This is Jesse's uh, Dent Side Super Cab Fummins. Really cool truck. This is going to Hawaii, a customer of ours. Here's Wyatt's truck. Um, so Wyatt's F-150, uh, you know, this front right frame rail is bent up a little bit, causing its hood to sit up high and its fender to not sit quite straight. So we're gonna take it down to a, a buddy of mine's, his body shop, he's got a frame stretcher. So we'll bring it down to his frame stretcher. And then once we get the frame stretched out, we pulled the bed off. Wyatt pulled the bed off before he brought it to us so it'd make it easier for the frame stretcher. But, um, you know, once we get it back, we'll, you know, clean the interior up real good. Just really kind of make this thing shine again and clean it up nice and and uh, polish his paint up. Put his bed back on and polish his paint up and make his truck look like, like, make his truck look like new again. So we're excited. It'll be a good time with him. It'll be a cool truck when he's all said and done. He'll be able to drive it for a long time. See Ethan here in just a few minutes and uh, give him the, the keys and title to that bad boy right there. I'm excited. There he is. <laughs> Holy boy. Look at that thing.
okay guys, so we've, we went and took our test drive. We're back in the shop now, and uh, just want to ask you guys a couple of questions and, and let the people get to know you. So tell us a little bit about yourself, Ethan, and where you guys are from and everything about you. Uh, Ethan Bailey, this is my 17-year-old son, Bowden. We're from Sydney, Montana, which is a, a little metropolis of about 5,000 people over on the North Dakota border. What did you think? First impressions of the truck, we just went and took a test drive. What did you think of it? It is badass. I don't know if I can say <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, but it yeah. is. Good. Bowden, what do you think? Yeah, I think it's freaking awesome. So, Bowden, like you're, you're an only child, right? Yeah. So, you think maybe one day this will be yours? I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> it's awesome. It's going to be an in the family wagon, which is Absolutely. really cool. What was going through your mind when I called you that night? I didn't believe it. I think I actually, actually almost argued with you. Like, <laughs> you're saying you won. I said, no, I didn't. Yeah, you did. No, I didn't. And, and about the third time, it finally sunk in that, oh my God, I really won. This is a real thing. That's awesome. But what did you think when he told you? I thought he was kidding. <laughs> I really thought he was joking. That's awesome. And who do you think is more excited, you or your wife? Because your wife on the phone, she was pretty ecstatic. She's, I don't know, it'd be close. It'd be real close. <laughs> what did you buy to get entered in to win? Um, my son had asked for uh, some LED uh, lights. He wanted to change some out on a, on a pickup we have. and. We bought some lights from you guys in the past, and they were good quality, and mm -hmm. so we ordered those. I ordered those as a Christmas present for him. I think along with a, a K5 T-shirt. That's cool. Because he likes old Chevys, and mm -hmm. and uh, sure enough, the gift I bought him turned out getting me a Christmas present. That's as well, awesome. Which is pretty cool. Great. That's great. And you've participated in like almost every single one of our giveaways. Yes, sir. Right. That's awesome. So, um, you know, we're really pumped for you. We're really excited. Um, we're gonna go load it up on his trailer and everything now, but uh, we're really pumped for you guys. It's exciting. They brought me a Montana flag and some Montana um, plates for it. Say 68 Wagoneer. We're really excited about that. Put it up on our fresh white walls in here. But um, awesome. this is gonna be fun. We'll be, you know, we'll be friends forever, and, yes, and it's gonna be great. So uh, yeah, no, congratulations once again. We've signed the title over, and time to take her back to Montana. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and uh, load the Wagoneer up on Ethan's trailer, and he's going to take off and go back up to Montana. So it's exciting, really fun. I'm really pumped for him. If you want to check out some more giveaways and see other people winning and maybe win one yourself, check us out here on YouTube or on Instagram uh, at Hudson Motors. Um, check out our website, HudsonMotors.com, where we sell all of the stuff for you to get entered in to win these trucks. If you're watching this video, we're probably doing a different giveaway right now, and so check us out and see what else we're giving away. Maybe you could be the next person that we bring down to Vegas to pick up your own cool little classic custom truck. So, all right, guys, we'll, we'll catch you on the next one. my hero sad days how cool is Happy that though days. how cool that's is that cool. dude that's rad